like I wanted to do a BDSM video about um, equal power between a sub and dom. Um, a lot of people, when they say that the sub has all the control, they think that the sub literally has all the control. And I've heard a lot of people think that that's true and that's how it works, but I wanted to do a video explaining how that's not true and that's not how it works. Um, I emailed this to myself, so I'm going to read it off. So please excuse me if I type, talk too fast or anything like that. So both sub and don have equal power in BDSM. A lot of us will say a sub has all the power and a lot of us mean that and then a lot of us are saying that so that people who are just starting don't think that they can have a say in anything going on because they are the sub. Now some people think when you say submissive that means you have no, t you, you cannot say a rule, you cannot say you don't want this, you cannot say you don't like this. And that's not true. Just because you're the submissive does not mean you don't have power. So I sometimes tell people that when they start, they have a lot of power. They have all the power to say what they don't want, don't do want. And sometimes I forget to add, don't forget the sub, the dom has the power too. That's my fault. And I regret not doing that now. But. The doms do not have all the power, and the sub does not have all the power. It is equally shared among both of you. Let's see. Remember that when you discuss stuff you both like and do not like, when you are sharing your thoughts and about what you're comfortable with and not comfortable with, so you're equal both there for all of that. You're both equal when it comes to rules and safe words. Doms can have safe words, and doms can have dom drop. That is a thing. Just so you know. Um, I'm not going to do a whole video on that because Evie has already done that, but yeah, so doms can have dom drop as well as subs having sub drop. Um, pretty sure doms could probably enter dom space. Um, I've never talked to a dom that has talked about that, but you never know. Um, they can have moments where they get scared or uncomfortable. Doms can end scenes as well. So doms can end scenes as well. If, dom, if a dom does not feel comfortable about doing something, they can end the scene. Just like the sub. If they are not comfortable with something, they can end the scene. Don't let your dom make you think that you can't stop the scene and don't let your sub make you think that you cannot stop your scene. If you're not comfortable with what's going on, you can stop it. Like um, Gonzo and I were playing one night and he did something and he was like, do we need to stop the scene? And I looked at him and said, yes sir because what, what he did made me uncomfortable and I, it hurt more than I was expecting it to. So he stopped the scene. So please remember it can go both ways. No one has more power than the other. Sometimes subs won't want a lot of power and sometimes subs won't well, don't want any power. Some subs just, they're like, they want no say. I don't want any say, I'm good. You, you have total power, you pick it, I'm good with whatever. Some subs are like, well, let's talk about it. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do that. Let's share the power. Da, 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 da. It just depends on what you're comfortable with. If you are completely okay with giving someone all the power, all the control over whatever situation you want them to control, that is on you. Good for you. There's nothing wrong with that. Don't let people make you think there's something wrong with that because there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. If you want to give over complete power, give over complete power. If you want to share the power, share the power. If you don't want them to have any power, you don't want them to have any power. I don't know if that's still considered BSM since it's kind of it's a power exchange. Still that power wouldn't work, but yeah. So, remember that. Um, let's see. Whatever you're comfortable with. But please remember all power is equal unless stated otherwise. So never think the sub has more power over the dom or the dom has more power over the sub unless they ask. So please remember that everything has to be discussed, everything has to be decided. I say this in every video, stay and safe from consensual. Always make sure you talk to your partner, discuss what you want, what you don't want, what you like, what you don't like, who gets more power, who gets less power, just whatever you're comfortable with, please, 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 please talk about it. If your partner is doing something you don't like, tap their hand, say you're safer, something. Just make sure you always discuss power of each other. Um, I wish Gonzo could have more power over me, but sadly he cannot because 
I am this. I'm a public, I'm a public feature, public figure, whatever, public figure, not feature. I'm a public figure and Gonzo can't control me because he really doesn't probably want me doing this, but he lets me do it because he knows I love it. He knows I love educating people, talking to people, meeting new people, everything else in the sun. So yeah, so Gonzo can have control over me the way I want him to and that's okay. Sometimes you cannot do that. Normal life can get in the way. And that is okay. So please don't forget, stay staying consensual, always talk, always equal power, share the power. If you don't want all the power, you don't want all the power. Work it out with your partner, always talk about it. And I love you guys and I'll see you in another video. Bye.